hello builds welcome to my youtube channel if you've not subscribed to this channel this will be the best time for you to quickly click on that subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so that you'll be the first person to be notified anytime there's an upfront coming from me prior to when i saw the comments of me making a review on skin sources that's Palmer's skin sources i already had pictures downloaded and when i saw the comments i was like wow <laughs> okay thanks for dropping a comment that i should make a review on this and please let's always drop comments on our videos so that we can know what next to make a review on that is really going to interest you the youtube channel is basically about you guys i'll basically talk about the lotion for today um i know that Pamas has um cup cream they have face cream they have day face cream they have face cream um for the night they have um face foam wash they have bar soaps i think i'll make a review on the bar soap immediately after i upload this video or probably in three days time from when i'll upload this video but for now let's focus on the body lotion yeah i cannot remember if i've actually made a video on a body lotion that will just glow you if i have not then probably this should be the first and if i have add this to your collection the Palmer's skin success is a very good body lotion stands as a brightening cream now when i mean brightening cream if you know you have intentions of lighting of lightening up your skin i don't think this is the best choice for you i'm using the word think because i cannot come and make conclusions for you guys all i have to do is tell you my review on a particular product right now for skin complexions this lotion is good for any skin complexion whether you're fair you're dark your caramel your choco any type of complexion or whatever you call the name of your complexion this particular lotion is good for all types of complexion now if you follow my video you know that there are some lotions i'll tell you that some particular skin complexion cannot use i think most of the things people concentrate on when it comes to giving review of lotions uh, skin types yeah and a normal or an average nigerian might not really want to understand what skin types are it's basically people who sell um, cosmetic products that deem it fit to know what skin types mean but for a normal nigerian to just basically understand what you're trying to say if you talk about skin complexion they get it more even though you can be a light skin person and have a dry skin and you can be a light skin person and have and oily skin these people will not come down to learn things like this well let me concentrate on the skin complexion that you people can quickly understand and quickly subscribe to this lotion has no business with skin lightening this lotion has no business with skin lightening i don't know how many times you people want me to repeat this as a caramel skin person um even if i go out and people tell me i'm light skin i'm sure they don't understand what caramel skin is I don't use lightening products. I use caramel products because these products will brighten up my complexion. It will brighten up my complexion and then you start looking at me, oh, she's fair. And then they will start using that word. It's not like she's that fair, but she's fair. <laughs> that is a practical definition of skin brightening. And the advantage of skin brightening is that you can easily control or rather you can easily control your discolorations i tell people that if you want to go into skin lightening journey number one it is more expensive and number two it is more stressful because you have to pay attention to yourself so that when you're lightening up your skin you can have a uniform complexion not like having dark feet and having lighter fingers and having um, dark back um, light chest you have to concentrate on these products and you have to use them in detail so you need hard work when it comes to skin lightening i mean like correct or healthy skin lightening mm -hmm. not a um, cook and fanta kind of skin lightening so if you're a caramel skin person this is just like a best thing for you it will brighten up your skin you're going to love your skin and you're going to be confident in it i feel like it's inferiority complex i used to make people even bleach their skin in the first place because your skin is looking dull you're not ready to invest your time and energy and even money into getting quality skincare products on my personal business page where i sell um cosmetic products or rather where i sell skincare products aphrodisia products feminine care products and all i always preach to people that we have no business with bleaching or we 
want to do is glow and look beautiful have a bright skin those that want skin lightening okay yes you're going to get skin lightening but it's going to be a gradual process you cannot just start up now and in the next three days you want your skin to be white no let's come back to the feed milk um parma skin success we're talking about i recommend this solution to somebody who is ready to take a new leave someone who has probably bleached their skin you see there are some products that are mild and that are very good but you cannot use them as a starter pack after bleaching because they will just make you lose hope they will start creating patches for you and all of that but you see this um parma skin success feed milk is a good to after a bleached skin yeah the only thing is that yes after you've bleached your skin and you want to start the correction process once you use the lotion and you finish the bottle you're going to get a bit darker and you're going to have discolorations yes but when you're on your second bottle it's going to help you fade the discoloration and you will start having uniform complexion Another advantage of the Parma Skin Success is that it is no support at knuckles. Yes, there are some brightening lotions that are just brightening lotions. They are not bleaching lotions, but still they will give you dark knuckles. Cap me anyway. So this lotion has no business with that. Then another thing I want you to know is that this lotion cannot be mixed. If you think you're a pro mixer and you want to mix this lotion, I'm very, very sorry to break your heart. You cannot do that. Then number two, if you're... If you're a DIY person, I just want to get this lotion, I want to mix it with oil, I want to mix it with... Please, don't. Don't. Just don't, don't. If you get the oil of this even particular product and you want to mix it, I always tell you, put your lotion on your palm, then pour the oil on your palm, then rub it on your body. But don't come and pour oil inside the lotion and say you want to mix it and you're just going to ruin the whole process and at the end of the day, you will not meet up to the expectations you you were thinking in your head that the lotion is going to do for you right so thanks for always coming back to my channel and i just hope this video has helped you in any way thanks for coming to my channel and i would like to see you in my next video bye for now